Hey, what's up? This is Danielle from Polygon, and I'm going to show you how to do the Merry Widow contract in The Witcher 3. I'm going to just skip right ahead to the fight here because it's so straightforward how to get to her. You just follow the signs like everything else. You use those Witcher senses to get to her. So she is weak to the Yarden Trap and Necrophage Oil. So what I did is I got ready by just sort of slathering that on my sword, and I made copious use of the trap here. I even sort of ate some damage uh, just in order to get some hits on her because she, her hits are not too, too bad here. She is really not the toughest enemy in the game. This is suggested level 10. I did this at nine, didn't run into too many problems, but again, I just made copious use of that trap sign, got her in there and then just wailed on her basically. Heavy attacks, quick attacks, mostly quick attacks, I sort of rolled out of the way whenever I was in my cooldown period to use my trap again. I really sort of spammed that as a strategy for her. Uh, she has this wacky sort of tongue maneuver here that she <laughs> looks like a big green vine, that sort of thing. I don't know if it's supposed to be a vine or what it's supposed to be, uh, but just roll out of the way of that. Just sort of keep her on her toes. And again, I just kept trapping her using that Yarden sign. Just keep wailing on her once she was in my little magic circle. She doesn't move too fast, which helps a lot for this. Uh, and she is really not the toughest enemy. It's a grave hag <laughs> that she was here. And yeah, spamming that strategy brought her down real quick. This is sort of my first attempt at this fight, so. And she drops some real good stuff. Always a nice thing, and you can return your reward like where you got the quest in Lindendale. And that's how you beat the Merry Widow. Thanks a lot.